Hi Tecla, how are you? This is Hondo with Saltown Chrysler. Just want to send you a nice little walk around video and this is on our 2020 Highlander Platinum Hybrid. Very nice vehicle. I love the new body style. I was actually working with Toyota Canada when um, uh, the, the previous uh, model and it was actually out there. So, I mean, I think they did a pretty good job. Very, very nice vehicle. Now this one does have the Looks like the LED or HID headlights, uh, and don't forget the flickering there. That's just a little camera play. Uh, always happens uh, uh, when you're videoing. Um, the LED fogs as well, or the, I believe they're LEDs, should be. Um, now it does have these sensors in the front as well. This one looks like it's got the 360 camera. Now it is raining. So I mean, Edmonton, you never know what's gonna happen, but I have not forgotten what you mentioned about the roof on this one, so I'll definitely make sure to give you a nice emphasis on that. But the body looks like it's in really nice shape. Looks like just a little bit of dirt on the side here. Uh, now this does have the parking sensors in the front. It does, I love how Toyota builds in the actual block heater underneath there. Um, and these would be those tires that are gonna get replaced. Okay, so there is a nice side profile. There's all the gray clouds we got going on. But I always like to give a little bit of an indication of the body lines, make sure you don't see any big, you know, bulges or anything on the, uh, uh, on the body itself. Now the rims do look nice. They do have a little bit of curb rash, just on a few of them. If you notice this one right here, this one is good. And just so you know too, the windshield is clean. So this rim is good as well. And this rim is good as well. Okay. Again, now here's some body lines on this side. Kind of love the way it's hunched over there. It looks really nice. Good profile. Um, sensors in the back as well. Now it does have one blemish. That's just going to be back here if you notice. Okay. So we still have sensors in the back. This does have your power tailgate. I love the blue badges on all the hybrids. Nice backup camera with the washer, just so you have an idea. Now, don't mind you, this is a fresh vehicle. It still has to get a full detail done. Uh, we have a nice JBL sound system. There's a nice little plug-in in the back, a proper wall outlet plug-in. You have your privacy cover as well. It is a full. Uh, captain's chairs in the second row. You got three in the back. And then this one does have the charging cord underneath. And then the spare tire is actually underneath the vehicle itself, okay? Now it does also have the blind spot assist. It has that nice, beautiful panoramic sunroof. And again, just note that I don't like to show vehicles before they've been like detailed and, one second. Before they've been detailed and everything, but at the end of the day with kind of the, you know, the quickness, I guess, of our inventory, we do kind of go through them pretty quick, so. Sometimes, you know, it just might actually not have time to, to have that full detail before it sells. Um, but it would get a full detail if you do buy it. I will tell you that right now. Heated seats in the back. This does also have a couple fast chargers and another proper plug-in. I like how they actually have the Highlander uh, rubber mats and privacy cover. Again, as you can tell, a little bit of a cleaning is all it needs. Just gonna put this down. So to get back, it's pretty simple. Just goes right up on the tracks. Now the last row, typically, your third rows are gonna be very lightly used. I just want to make sure you know that there's no rips and tears or anything like that. Even the headliner is clean. Okay, 
so we got outside heated mirrors this does have the two position driver memory it does have like i mentioned that nice jbl sound system when it comes to the seats itself there's no rips no tears love that kind of cross stitching design that they have and then obviously this nice privacy cover depending on where you are parks you know sometimes when you have to call a coliseum you got to be a little cautious all righty so even the passenger side here if you notice no rips no tears love that panoramic roof now we have a couple fast chargers up here love the storage area with that nice little convenient spot to, to kind of pull your wires through um, now this one does also obviously have an electronic parking brake with the auto hold ev mode trail mode and then it also has your sport normal economical mode that will change the way the transmission shifts and the way the steering feels actually um, now this does as i mentioned have the heated seats the heated steering wheel it actually has the heating element underneath the wiper blades there to make sure you never have to bang your wiper blades again automatic high beams this is all part of toyota safety sense that's standard on all new vehicles so you have adaptive cruise control lane keeping assist automatic high beams now this one also has if you notice in the back there in the trunk uh, to turn on that nice 120 volt uh, um, uh connection there now this one literally i think it was just the other day a uh, check engine light came on obviously this vehicle has 69 69 000 k it is what i said almost eighth or ninth generation hybrid tech so this is definitely a pretty small thing that obviously they'll have through the shop um and again i can assure you after driving that there's no actual issue with the vehicle this is nowadays with the electronics i mean you can have a gas cap loose and you're going to get a check engine like come on um now the nice thing is the ac is blowing ice cold we have air conditioned seats we have heated seats now this one particularly as well does have the navigation i kind of like how they got a dual screen setup thing going on um now backup camera as well i did mention it has the 360 a couple different viewing angles which is really nice and then other than that this is going to be your wireless charging i love how they kind of have this really smooth system right there and then this just folds right up and then we have some additional storage in there now there's a lot of storage in here even up in the cubby holes up there we have our glove box actually before i forget let me go quickly show you the roof Okay, this will be a good angle. So you'll be able to see if there's any dimples or anything at all. I don't see anything. Or maybe I'm just getting old, but I don't think so. Okay, <laughs> eyes are pretty good. Other than that though, I mean, blemishes. I think we got a light scratch over here. We got a light little scuff just over here. I mean, pretty minor stuff at the end of the day. And sorry, the car wash next door was just not working at the ESO there. And we have one little small, oops, one little small scratch right there. Again, pretty small, like even when you feel them, can't even get my nail in there. So another little small one right there. Alrighty, okay, I'm gonna take this one for a quick drive. Okay, turn the fan off. Nice little digital display, and I do like the fact that they got a digital uh, speedometer there. Now, heads up display, I'm, I'm hoping you can see that. Really nice, it even shows your lane keeping functions. This is a nice one digital rear view mirror and i did mention this has a nice audio system all right let's see not. So 
see if I can tune this too. Sound. Really nice sound system. really nice sound system it's actually very clear as well all righty now there's your power meter on that side there and again i like the heads up display and it's very easy to adjust as well just kind of based on your height preferences or the height situation <laughs> all right now this one definitely is very peppy now if you're not familiar with the hybrids um, it's really nice because they all have regenerative braking with, um, with Toyota there, right? So essentially, while you're slowing down, while you're stopping, your battery is charging. So it's a really nice system. And you do find that the brakes with the regenerative braking actually do grip a lot harder. So you actually feel that. Not that it's uncomfortable or it's hard to, hard to modulate. Um, it just overall, it, they just seem to have a little bit more bite and strength to them. Um, but here's a walk around video. Tecla, I really hope you liked the video as well as Gino. My name is Hundo again, Southtown Chrysler. So working a beautiful stormy day, golf course next door there. So nothing but fun times. Give me a shout when you get this. Hopefully we can set something up with you folks. And as I mentioned, the only thing this one is uh, really set to get is just going to be those tires if if we wanted to do something, right? So um, give me a shout, 780-932-7597. Thank you so much.